All right. Yeah, now I remember why I don't cover uh, drip forks. They're a little too confusing. Okay, so everyone's been covering this, so now I'm going to cover it. I don't normally cover drip forks, but I'm going to make an exception in this case because... Yeah, you know, I just want the I just want the traffic in SEO, and to be honest, that, that's all I care about. Obviously, I'm not gonna, gonna invest in this project because um, the problem with drip forks is they're still subject to the same problems as you know crypto. Like everything goes down anyway, right? And and then you, you're getting only one percent a day. I'd rather just have a freaking Titano fork. <laughs> I'd rather buy Sphere or Titano, right? Or Web three or Seifu. Uh, oh, and I didn't mention this, but this is another thing too. I don't think I actually will trust Certic or Jesse Eccles Obsidian Council anymore. I mean, they still carry a lot of weight and I'll still invest accordingly. But if I were to run a project, I personally would not never hire them. Because I really don't like what Certic did to Seifu and I really do not like what Jesse Eccles did to Titano. It's like, you know, like, because when you FUD like that, you fuck up everyone else's bags. Like, it's like, like, believe it or not, it's actually a gray area, and that could be considered illegal here in America, too. Like, nothing's going to happen, of course, but it is actually a thing, right? You, basically, it's like, you know, securities fraud, right? Like, hey, go buy this thing, and then you dump on them, right? Now, big corporations get away with it all the time, so, but you're not a big corporation. You and I are not, so, <laughs> whatever. <clears throat> anyway, this is a drip fork network kind of deal and you can see there are 809 people already in here it pays two percent returns i mean they should okay well i guess that didn't matter the max token supply of some kind is a million uh so i had to kind of like figure out like where is what all right so surge i so i believe this is your base token so that's what this chart is they're, they're only a week old so this is the base token price for tsunamis all right, so it does it does have a nice little ring to it, and then of course I don't know, you can just take a look at whatever the hell this is. Uh, so you can buy and sell it here. Uh, okay, good. There's a balance. Uh, this is obviously not my balance. This is, I guess, the project's balance of Avax. Okay, great. Uh, and then this is your little uh, pyramid scheme, uh, multi-level marketing thing where you, you know, you get. Uh, now, if, if I remember correctly, in order to join this, you have to get the address of like a different uh, guy that's already in this project. So you can go on Yada Crypto or Murdoch DeFi's uh, YouTube if you want to use them. I'm not, I'm not going to do this, so that's why you're not going to see my thing here. And then you could, you could see your affiliate uh, downlines, I guess. Uh, he's, this looks exactly like a phone number, all right? Because it says one plus or plus one, and you got to put in the phone number. Uh, investors begin by purchasing uh, Tsunami from the Surge page, which is this one. To do so, require joining an existing investor. So that means you do need someone's uh, address here. Apparently, you could use your own address. Okay. Team viewer. Um, okay. Do so require... There is one tsunami. So this is very easy for people to get into. It just requires one tsunami, which is obviously just like $4. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. So they have a link to this, which is Typhoon. Um, well, I hope they talk about that here. All right. Oh, yeah. And the 2% return lasts for six months. So, or 180 days. So you get back 360% eventually. Uh, tsunami rewards. Why is my nose running? Are generated from the 10% tax on all buy and sell transactions. So this has a 10% tax on everything. Which is technically good because you want... Yeah, you want to try to get a cut of the, uh, you know, buy and sell pressure and, of course, the super predators. But again, I don't know why you would do something like this. I right? just, just just do Titano or Sphere. Yeah, I mean, it's annoying to have to get, you know, your friends or whatever, but you just make more money just doing, because they pay twice. Well, Titano will pay twice as much, and Sphere will pay the same APY, 
for at least another four months. So, and version two is coming out in seven days. Sim just made the announcement in the Discord. So again, this is why I don't like doing drip forks. It's like, yeah, and then I have to open another freaking tab for something that's very complicated. Uh, deflationary. Okay, and then whatever. Uh, the ability. Okay. The this ability is unlocked by holding. By holding based on the amount of Typhoon tokens held, but not stake in your wallet. Okay, so Typhoon is this, which is very cheap. It only costs 18 cents. So if you're looking to do a drip fork on the cheap, this is definitely what you use, uh, Tsunami. Now they're paying for a lot of marketing. Alright, because I don't think Murdoch, because I think Murdoch and Yada Crypto only take payments. I assume, or maybe they, I don't know. But with that being said, you know, this uh, this is pretty cheap. So if you want one referral underneath you, you need two Typhoons. That's 36 cents. If you want 15 levels deep, this is 1,600 times 18%. It is like $36 or I don't know. I don't really feel like doing the math, but it's really cheap. It's like 36 bucks or less than that or something like that. Oh, geez. I guess we'll actually calculate this. 15, 9, 7 times 18 cents. Okay, I was way off. So you have to pay $287.46, which is still pretty cheap. Alright, so I'm not going to do this. Obviously, this is just way too convoluted for me. Don't, so don't use my address. Also, I'm not in this product, so you can't use this address even if you wanted to. Because I just simply push this button just to see what it does. Uh, but it's a pretty small scale project. Um, let's see. Yeah, and they're they have all that marketing and very few followers. It's very interesting. Okay, I don't know. You can check this project out. I obviously just don't really care. Uh, so I guess the only drip fork that I'll cover in the future is if I see ever everyone else doing it, and I just want because to me, funny enough, ranking this video on YouTube is more valid valuable to me than playing this project, which is pretty funny. Right, but I mean, th these prices are very, very cheap and low. So I don't know. Maybe they also did a stealth launch too. I guess. I mean, they have benefits and downsides, but the clear downside is you just don't get a lot of money flowing in because there's no hype and you stealth launched. So whales are like, yeah, whatever, I pass. See, that's the thing. Like whales are double-edged swords, right? Everyone focuses on the negatives of a whale, but not the positives. Like whales bring in a lot of effing money. All right, and if you're taxing them, then well, wash them well when they leave your project, because you got you got like 10, 20, 15 percent of all their profits, all right? So if someone's like putting in one million dollars, you just made like your project just made like two hundred, uh, one hundred thousand to, you know, two hundred fifty thousand dollars, all right? If your tax is twenty five percent, so I mean, no, no, I think that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. And then your price drops, right, to almost nothing. And then you can either walk away from the project, screwing over your all your investors, right, the small guy, or you could just buy, or you could spend like, I don't know, twenty percent of your tax and revenue and just buy back the project, right? Just just pump the price back up and then do marketing and whatever. So whatever. Anyway, check out Tsunami. I'm done for the day. I'm actually gonna get hungry. I got a lot of stuff to do. I want some Burger King again. You know, I've been getting a little bit of weight. Just want to walk around. And what was that weird beeping sound? Did you hear that beeping sound? Hopefully it's not a bomb. Obviously it's not, but... Uh, let me just manage this shit. Okay. Uh, research. Yes. Let me do some research here. Alright, claim, 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 claim. Alright. Um, hmm. I don't know. Anyway, like, subscribe, share the video. You know, to be honest, do I really care? Um, yeah, I'll post all four links, whatever. I'm done for the day. I'll see you all tomorrow for the 100 Days Ventures launch. I obviously have no idea what I'm going to do with it because, I don't know. I I mean, would it, would it be like buying Titano on the cheap? That's really the only thing I could think of. Eh, I don't know. I'll have to check the Elite Discord. In fact, let's just take a look at what they're saying real quick. I mean, I might as well hit the public button on this one, too. Uh, oh, boy. Oh, man, there's so much shit here. 
okay, so MDB is saying still huge. It's a real world game, still a Prox and Xbox PCs, PCs. Yeah, that doesn't mean anything. Not as big as I'd hope, but 100 days could easily be the main launch pad for AAA crypto games. Me, I'm still there, but there's spawning out of the cross. Which are not the portfolio stands out. Uh, is already in talks with that Chris guy Ahmad mentioned that the other day. I'm gonna go vote. Uh, yeah, I want to hear it out. Maybe God. Okay. Uh, yeah, so then why keep delaying? They had nothing that works, but then Sphere came along and they were like, oh shit, we got a V2. Yeah, that's the one thing I really don't like about Titano. I really despise the fact that it's still going up simply because they're the first alpha male. So, ah, very frustrating. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay. All right, I'll, yeah. I still remain skeptical about 100 Days Finance, uh, 100 Days Ventures or whatever the hell they call themselves, so... All right, I'll see you all tomorrow, regardless if I put my money into that or not. And um, yeah, enjoy the rest of your day or night. I'm out. Like, subscribe, share this video, uh, grow, help grow the channel. Thank you again to all the new people. There are you people. All right, thank you again to all the new people that are coming in. I've got a very busy day. I want to relax, exercise, and i got to get ready for a big debate tonight. That's uh, between uh, St. Nick and his crew versus some guy named Medicare. Uh, apparently he's some has-been asshole. Uh, and he's just looking, and the, the Medicare guy, I guess, is just looking for some attention because nobody pays attention to him. So, I don't know. I'm just going to find out what it is. All right. All the big political people, the real ones that, that move the movement, are actually going to be in that debate. So, I got to find out. In fact, uh, in fact, I actually noticed, I don't know who this Michael Alberto guy is, but uh, let me see. Yeah, but apparently they're already following me, so obviously I followed them back as soon as I found out, like, a couple days ago. But yeah, I already retweeted this, so, yeah. Alright. Uh, you know, if Japanese anime became NFTs, I bet that would be huge. See, that is something I would actually look into buying, alright? So, I don't know, if 100 Days Ventures could get in on this, right, if they could bring in the coding people necessary... And apparently they do have some kind of partnership-ish with uh, Little Orbit, right? I mean, I don't know. I don't know how, how good their coding ability really is. I don't know. It's going to be Little Orbit. All right, they don't have just three games, I think. Okay, uh, looking for QA, Director of Game Programming, and that's that's pretty much it. They are in Santa Ana, California, or in London. That's, is that really all? I do know that people really like APP Reloaded. Thing is, I don't know if they're thing works because like the game constantly has problems oh it's free to play huh. well i guess if cross out doesn't work i could play this game because i've been playing that recently because i've been looking for a game that's just been fair uh yeah i mean i'm very active yeah this is a very small studio i don't know i'll think about it maybe i could put in like a thousand dollars is already a lot of effing money for 100 Days Ventures, but maybe it might pan out. I don't know. See you all tomorrow. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm out. So, blah, blah, blah.